Hi, Carlo Ami here with your Wake Up Wild for uh, Saturday, the 10th of December. And uh, tonight we're going to talk about power. What's, what's power? We're raised to believe, uh, so many of us, uh, that the power has to do with accumulating wealth or being able to manipulate other people. Maybe it's about having a fancier car or a prettier partner. And these are all things that we've identified with as being powerful. And by having these things that we will be more powerful. And it's all artificial, that kind of power. I mean, it's not real. The only kind of power there is, is that which has love as, it, as its foundation. If it's not loving, it ain't powerful. We've been raised a whole different way. It's a false way. It says that to feel better about yourself, you have to screw over somebody else. It says that to feel better than the guy next door, I need to have a better car, or more money in the bank. It says to feel better right now, I can just stuff my face with food that's really stupid. And it's all BS power. So, as you go into your weekend, I ask you to consider the possibility that if you intend to be truly powerful as you move through these chaotic times that we're in the middle of, then you may find it much easier to do this, more fluid, more graceful, more powerful, truly powerful. If you choose to see what true power is and trust that you have it within you, to use that power wisely in a way that would be dictated by your heart. So think about this as you go into your weekend, please. And it's, uh, I have to give you a quote here from one of the great teachers uh, for me, uh, named Osho. And what he said is that the, the mind makes a wonderful slave, but a terrible master. And what I ask you to think about as you go into your weekend, what part of the real me do I intend to, to display to the world and to live? Is that part of me that's insecure and fearful? Or is that part of me that sometimes feels scary because we don't know it? That part of me that's uh, divine and powerful and it's divine and powerful as everybody else is in death. But we've been raised to think that we should fear. So choose your powers you go into your weekend, please. And to know that that power is based in your heart. It's not any kind of idiotic things that your mind thinks. Your mind ain't you. Have a great weekend.